Imagine a surgeon opening up your chest and working directly on your heart with careful precision. That's what we call open heart surgery. Today, I'm going to walk you through exactly how this kind of surgery is done, step by step. It starts with the patient being placed under general anesthesia, meaning they're put into a deep sleep and won't feel a thing or be aware of anything during the procedure. Next, the surgeon makes an incision down the center of the chest and gently separates the breastbone to get full access to the heart. To keep things safe while the heart is still, a machine called a heart-lung bypass machine is used. It temporarily takes over the heart's job, pumping blood and supplying oxygen throughout the body. With that support in place, the surgeon can go ahead and fix the issue. That might involve repairing or replacing a damaged heart valve or performing a bypass to allow blood to flow around a blocked artery. Once everything that needs to be done is completed, the breastbone is brought back together and the incision is carefully closed. After that, the patient is moved to a recovery area where doctors and nurses closely monitor them as they begin to wake up. Although this is a highly technical and serious procedure with some risks, it can be life-saving and it's helped countless people return to normal and often even healthier lives.